Hi, my name is Allie, and welcome to my channel. Today, I'm going to take this entertainment center and hopefully make it look better. If you're new to my channel, I do mommy and lifestyle videos, and that kind of entails pretty much whatever random stuff I come up with to make videos of, and today is one of those random videos. Over here, I have our white entertainment center. We bought this when we moved into our place we live in now, and I love having the white furniture, but as I have gotten other pieces that kind of go in our living room, I've realized I have some like darker tones here and there. I really want to find a way to help kind of tie in this white furniture with some of our darker furniture. And so I saw a picture on Pinterest, I'll insert it right above here, and it was for a kitchen but it was the white cabinets, it had the darker kind of matte blackish brownish color on the insides of the cabinets, and they were open. And I was like, oh, that looked really cool. But we live in a place that we rent, and we can't, you know, do anything to the actual stuff here. But we can do stuff to our own furniture, and I really liked how that looked. And then I thought, that might look actually really good in our entertainment center to paint the inside of all of these shelves that matte blackish color to help tie in the other dark parts in our room. So I went to the hardware store, I got my paint, my primer, paintbrush, sanding stuff, and I thought I'd give it a go. And note, this is my first like actual DIY besides doing random crafts, and so I don't know how this will turn out, but hopefully it will turn out good. The items I have to do this are a paintbrush, the random store sticks that come with the paint, sanding paper, which I ended up getting the multi-purpose sandpaper and it's assorted, so it's got different types and textures, I don't know what exactly I'm going to need. And the paints. First up, I have this 123 Bullseye Primer, and she had it tinted with a grayish color, and she said that will help a lot with not having to do as many coats of the main paint. She said because it's darker, it will kind of help get things darker, so I don't have to use so much of the main paint. Moving on to the main paint. The color I did is called, what is that color called? Midnight Stroll. The color name that I picked is called Midnight Stroll. This is the color swatch card, and it's just a nice kind of matte black color, but it almost has like a hint of a grayish or brownish tone. I can't quite figure it out, but this is the color we wanted to go inside the shelves. Brand is Benjamin Moore. It's the Regal Select, and I got it in the matte finish, and just so that it would have a nice just matte finish, no glossiness or anything like that. And that was all I got, and so hopefully, this will be enough paint. I cleared out some of it, but I need to get the rest of the stuff out. Give it a quick wipe down. Then I'm going to start sanding it. a lot easier. You can tell I don't do that many sanding projects and I'm not sure what each sandpaper does. So I have this type. I'm assuming that's fine. This feels like a medium. And this feels like hard. Let's pick one.
was one of the shelves that I took out and did a general sanding of it. But now I'm going to move on to priming. Again, it's the Bullseye 123 Primer and it's tinted with a gray tint to help not have to use as many coats of the other paint. First, it's recommended that you cover your nice <laughs> carpets before priming and painting. This is what the gray tinted primer looks like. And so I'm going to do a base coat on all the shelves and go from there. Still debating if I want to do a third coat or not. Probably will, but for now, this is how it is, and I really like it. Thanks for stopping by my channel. I hope you enjoyed this DIY redoing my entertainment center. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below if you'd like to join along. Me and my family and our channel. This little guy's getting into stuff. And a treat. It snowed last night. Yep, and it's not even Thanksgiving.